everyone. My name is Colton Wright. I'm a product marketer on analytics and trust and security here at Zendesk, and I'm excited to walk you through everything new with trust and security this quarter and how Zendesk is helping your team stay compliant and help protect your customer data. Zendesk invests in tools that empower businesses to safeguard their customers' data and provide options in data privacy, enabling them to be compliant with regulations and build trust with their customers. Zendesk offers a simple and elegant approach to keeping customer service data secure. Zendesk's combination of security, customization, and ease of use make it an ideal choice for businesses looking to enhance their customer experience. A trend we're seeing in trust and security is the demand for businesses to keep their customer data protected. Consumers are far more aware of the impact of data breaches than they ever were before, and they have a better understanding of how those data breaches can affect them. In fact, customers are demanding more protections be in place, and a whopping 71% of customers say that they would stop doing business with a company that didn't protect their data privacy. Today, we'll explore three features that play a vital role in safeguarding your sensitive data and maintaining the trust of your customers and employees. The first feature we'll look at is blocking agents from sensitive tickets. Next, implementing two-factor authentication for end users. And finally, leveraging new permission enhancements. So let's get to it. As you may know, our agents have the capability to submit tickets on behalf of end users while seeking support from internal departments like HR and IT. However, this creates a challenge in terms of security and privacy. Without this feature, agents have access to private comments and agent-only fields on tickets that they submit as requesters. This feature prevents agents from accessing such sensitive information. And by implementing this feature, we significantly enhance security. It accurately identifies and authenticates users preventing unauthorized access or malicious activities. This critical security layer protects our customers' data. Additionally, this feature enables private conversations within internal departments like HR and IT, ensuring confidentiality. Sensitive matters can be discussed securely, maintaining privacy for all parties involved. This feature provides improved security, privacy, and effective ticket management. Agents are blocked from accessing sensitive information, enhancing the overall security measures. It enables confidential internal discussions and ensures clear user differentiation for better ticket management and support allocation. Next, we're expanding two-factor authentication, 2FA, to end users, not just team members. By expanding two-factor authentication, we significantly enhance security by adding an extra layer of protection to user accounts making it harder for unauthorized individuals to gain access. This helps safeguard sensitive information, prevents unauthorized transactions, and mitigates the risk of data breaches. By extending 2FA to end users, organizations can instill a sense of trust and confidence among their user base. Users are far more likely to feel secure and have peace of mind knowing that their accounts are protected by an additional security measure. Two-factor authentication can help reduce the overall risk of account compromise. Even if a user's login credentials are compromised through things like phishing attacks or password breaches, the second factor of authentication acts as a barrier, preventing unauthorized access. This helps mitigate the impact of compromised passwords and reduces the likelihood of account takeovers. Finally, we're introducing new permission enhancements that help improve business productivity by granting agents more advanced permissions minimizing the need for a large number of admins and streamlining operations. The first feature, Ticket Delete Schedules Permission, allows agents to manage deletion schedules and reduce dependency on administrators or routine deletion tasks. This empowers agents to take ownership of data management within their assigned responsibilities, leading to a more streamlined workflow. The second feature allows agents to access suspended tickets. Customers utilizing private groups are losing access to suspended tickets unless they set the ticket access to all, which defeats the purpose of having private groups. To address this challenge and preserve the benefit of private groups, we're introducing a new permission specifically for suspended tickets. By granting agents partitioned access and allowing them to triage suspended tickets, we strike a balance between maintaining privacy and ensuring efficient ticket management. Finally, a new permission enhancement, non-admins can manage team members, is separate from the admin role 
and empowers our customers to delegate team management responsibilities to specific individuals who require them, while ensuring that they don't have access to all of the administrative permissions. This allows for more granular control and flexibility in assigning responsibilities without compromising overall security or granting excessive privileges. And now let's take a look at a demo that shows how the new block agents from Sensitive Ticket feature works. Meet Kino, an admin at Peer and Medical, a health services company. Peer and Medical primarily uses Zendesk to communicate externally with its customers with a customer support team. Recently, Peer and Medical has expanded from customer support to include new departments such as HR for internal purposes. Kino wants to ensure the privacy and security of Peer and Medical's employees and prevent customer support agents from accidentally accessing internal HR tickets. Kino now has the ability to block agents from sensitive tickets from varying groups. All Kino needs to do is navigate to roles within the admin center to set this up. Kino will need to determine the parameters for what type of tickets and permissions this role will need. Let's see what happens when a customer support agent from Peer and Medical submits an internal request to HR. In this scenario, Riley wants to transfer to another city, and when she goes to submit the ticket, she's prompted that future access to the ticket will be limited and viewable just like a customer would be able to see it. Upon submission, Riley wants to check her ticket just to make sure it went through, and it checks out. With the ability to block agents from sensitive tickets, your organization has more flexibility in managing complex and sensitive conversations, surpassing our previous capabilities to include support for use cases such as internal support requests like what we just reviewed, escalations and collaborative support, VIP or high priority customers, external support requests, and agent training and testing. And that's what's new with Trust and Security this quarter. If you'd like to dive deeper, check out the Help Center in resources below. Thank you.